Do you enjoy games with crafting and exploration mechanics that you can personalize making the gameplay experience your own? Or management life simulation games with exciting narratives? How about cozying up to relaxing and chill games but with a hint of whimsy? If you answered yes to all of those, then this video is for you. For this week's video, we'll be looking into new game launches, release dates, devlog updates of beloved indie titles, and more. So grab your snacks, cozy up, and let's get right into it. First up is Cozy Caravan. The game has just launched on Steam Early Access, blending crafting, trading, and exploration in a beautifully designed cozy world. In Cozy Caravan, you navigate picturesque landscapes, setting up mobile markets in each new town. Throughout delightful mini-games, they can craft a variety of items to trade with local townsfolk. The game features a diverse cast of characters, each with unique stories and quests, enhancing the immersion of the game. My favorite part is the customization which allows you to create your own persona. And together with Baba, explore, trade, and engage in fun activities with townsfolk, making every stop along the road an opportunity for new adventures and connections. Then we have Fairytale Furnishing. The game launched on May 17, offering a relaxing interior design experience with a whimsical twist. In Fairytale Furnishing, you can customize various fairytale homes like a princess's tower or a hero's cabin. The aim is to enjoy the process of creating beautiful interiors without any pressure. As you progress, you unlock new items to enhance your designs and uncover a story that links the characters. The narrative introduces a beautiful princess, an evil witch, a brave hero, and a stern king, but with a modern twist. There's wireless internet. And not all characters are what they seem. Perfect for fans of cozy games and fairytale settings, Fairytale Furnishing lets players decorate homes for iconic fairytale characters while exploring a playful narrative. Up next is Synergy. The game is officially launching in early access on May 21st. In the latest devlog, it was revealed how the game's art style was inspired by the work of Mobius. The art style features rough trembling lines and soft curves with debris of lines to emulate organic movement. And color coding was implemented to help players quickly identify different types of buildings, which is something I appreciate. In Synergy, you build and manage a city in a mesmerizing yet unforgiving environment. The well-being of citizens is paramount, requiring players to explore, analyze, and experiment with their surroundings. What I like is that the game encourages a sustainable approach to city building, with you needing to understand and adapt the natural environment. You can send citizens on expeditions to discover new regions, meet other survivors, and gather valuable knowledge. Building 9 unique districts with specific bonuses helps foster city development. The ultimate goal is to create a thriving city that meets the needs of its citizens while harmonizing with the natural world. Synergy offers a visually appealing and immersive experience, combining strategic city building with artistic inspiration from Mobius. Moving on, we have Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip. The game is gearing up for release on May 30. You will join Terry on an exciting quest to launch himself into space using his new car, aiming to become a local legend through this daring adventure. The game promises a journey filled with running, driving, and gliding as Terry works towards his lofty goal. Whether on foot, by car, or paraglider, the compact open world is yours to discover. The game's story unfolds through humorous interactions with quirky residents, adding a layer of warmth and whimsy. The game also features a variety of fun activities such as catching insects, digging holes, smashing cars, getting rich, and wearing different hats. These elements add depth and enjoyment to the gameplay experience. With a joyful and heartwarming soundtrack for the composer of Lopo, Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip offers an engaging blend of humor, adventure, and high-speed excitement. The game promises to be a delightful escape into a world of quirky characters and fun-filled discoveries. Next up is Ever After Falls. The game is set to launch this summer on all major platforms, including Steam, Nintendo Switch, Microsoft Xbox, and PlayStation 4 and 5. In Ever After Falls, you awaken to find that your previous peaceful life was all a simulation. With no memory of this quaint place or its friendly animal neighbors, you'll soon discover that Ever After Falls feels like home. Spend time reconnecting with your old friends and your helpful pet as you rebuild your life in this cozy town. You'll farm, fish, and fight your way back to prominence using your skills to manage your farm and progress through challenging dungeons. Engage in small-town drama through quests and conversations and tackle farm challenges with a friend in split-screen co-op. With four different dungeons to explore, each testing your agility, strength, and cunning, you'll have plenty of adventures to keep you busy in Ever After Falls. Now let's move on to Garden Witch Life. The game is casting its spell on consoles. This charming game will be available on the Switch, Xbox Series X and S, PlayStation 5, and of course on Steam and Epic. In Garden Witch Life, you find yourself in a quaint town far from home after losing your job. Fate lands you in a vacant witch's house where you begin a new chapter of your life. 
You will build and nurture a magical garden, growing plants for potions and spells, while forging friendships with the local townsfolk. As you settle into the witch's house, you'll work on cleaning, repairing, and upgrading it, making it your cozy haven. Becoming part of the community, you'll participate in festivals and daily life, building friendships and supporting each other through the seasons. Explore the island's mysterious history, uncovering hidden passages and ancient texts. Over time, you'll improve your skills and tools, becoming a master gardener and witch. And yes, you can pet all the adorable critters you encounter. Up next is Moonfrost, a free-to-play life sim farming RPG coming soon to PC and mobile. The exclusive alpha test runs from May 29 to June 7, giving players an early look at the game's exciting new features and integrations. The game offers an ever-expanding mysterious world full of secrets to uncover where you customize your character, build relationships, and explore diverse environments. In Moonfrost, you'll start your journey with a humble homestead that needs some serious DLC. You can customize and upgrade your space, transforming it into a rickety shed into a cozy home. Based on community feedback, the developers have made significant improvements. Character models have been revamped for better alignment with the game's pixel art style. Water shaders have been stabilized, enhancing both gameplay and visual feedback. The crafting system has also undergone a major overhaul with new crafting sites, improved UI, and refined resources. Moonfrost is still in alpha, and player input continues to drive its development. Moving on, we have Solar Punk. The game's developers just dropped their latest devlog. Initially, an NPC merchant for buying goods and blueprints was planned, but it was decided to remove this feature to enhance the feeling of being stranded in a vast, untamed world. The revamped platform now features a charming front garden, a redesigned interior, and a new cockpit room. It serves as a hub for players, accessible only by airship. You can repair various electrical devices on the platform to unlock new crafting recipes and improve gameplay experience. A responsive system was also introduced where players drop their items upon death, which can be retrieved if they return in time. This system aims to balance challenge and playability with potential adjustments based on player feedback during the alpha phase. And there you have it for this week's update. Are there any games that caught your eye? Check out this video if you want more updates of cozy, farming simulation games from indies to established titles. Trust me, you won't want to miss it. Stay awesome, gamers!